You may have heard this before, but it definitely doesn't mean it's not true. A few minutes of movement every morning will do the body so much good. So today on Surviving Yoga, I've got a quick morning yoga sequence for you. Most of us spend the majority of our day hunched over when we drive to work, hunched over typing at our computer, and then hunched over in a little ball when we sleep. So the best way to start your day is by counteracting that hunching motion by opening up your body, doing some yoga movements, and this will help to energize you for your entire day. So the first pose in our sequence is gonna help to open up your side body, your lungs, and it's gonna give you a nice neck release. So come to a comfortable seated position with your legs crossed. Bring your hands alongside your body, and then on an inhale, you'll lift your arms, look up, and then exhale to release. And then repeat, inhale, look up. Exhale, drop your right hand beside your body and come into a side bend. Keeping length through the left side of your body and really reaching through your left fingertips. Make sure to keep your right shoulder down away from your ear and breathe. And you can hold this pose for as long as is comfortable. And when you're ready to come out, just slowly lift part of the way up, bringing your left hand about a foot off the floor, really reaching through those fingertips, and just let your neck completely go, really release here. And you should feel a great stretch all along the side of your neck. Again, keep breathing. Keep your right shoulder dropped away from your right ear, and breathe. And then when you're ready to come out, just slowly come up, Bring your right hand to your head and lift your head back to center. Then you'll bring your hands beside your body and do the entire sequence again on the other side. Next up, we're gonna move into some cat-cow movements and this will help to warm up your spine in the morning and just give you a little bit of movement through your entire body. So to start off, come onto your hands and knees with your wrists stacked directly under your shoulders and your knees stacked directly below your hips. On an inhale, you're gonna drop your belly, lift your chest and look up. And on an exhale, you'll round your spine, tucking your tailbone and looking towards your navel. And you can continue this for as many rounds as you'd like, looking up, dropping your belly on an inhale and rounding your spine and looking towards your navel on an exhale. Now we'll add some additional movements into your cat-cow that will help to build some heat in your core. So on an inhale, lift your right leg up behind you, lifting your chest, and then on an exhale, round your spine, bringing your knee right towards your chest. And then you can repeat this as many times as you'd like, inhaling, looking up, lifting your right leg, and exhaling, rounding in, bringing your knee into your chest. And then when you're finished, just bring your right knee down to the floor, and then repeat on the left side. Now that we've warmed up your core, we'll transition to downward facing dog. So to move from table position into downward facing dog, root your hands into the floor and spread your fingers out nice and wide. And then you're slowly gonna start to shift your hips back and then up. And don't worry if you need to bend your knees, that's totally fine, because we're trying to create a straight line right from your fingertips all the way up to your hips. So just bend your knees to create this nice straight line. And this is gonna help to start to warm up your hamstrings in the morning, and you can feel free to walk your dog, bending one knee at a time, and shifting your hips around a little bit just to warm up your body. We'll also add in one hip opener to the sequence, and this will be a really great way to give you a stretch along your hips and along the front of your thigh. So to begin this knee down lunge, you're gonna come from downward facing dog and bring your right foot up beside your hand. And then you're gonna drop your left knee to the floor and then slowly lift your hands up onto your right knee and stay here and breathe. If you want an additional stretch, you can also inhale your arms up above your head and look up. And then when you're ready to come out, simply drop your hands beside your foot and step back and up into downward facing dog. Then you can simply repeat on the other side. To finish off, we're gonna do a simple seated twist. And this is great to stimulate your internal organs and just give you a little bit of detoxifying before you start your day. So come to a comfortable seated position and sit up nice and tall. Bring your right hand to your left knee and bring your left hand behind you. Now inhale to sit up nice and tall and then exhale to twist and look over your left shoulder. And then keep breathing here on each inhale, lifting up and exhaling, twisting a little bit deeper. And hold this for as long as is comfortable, and then gently return back to center and repeat on the other side. 
If you have some additional time in the morning, you can also add in some meditation or breathing exercises. You can watch my videos on those two subjects right up here, and I'd love to know what your favorite stretch is to do in the morning, so let me know in the comments below. And I'll see you next time on Surviving Yoga. If you love stretching, make sure to subscribe to Coral. And even if you like sleeping more than stretching, also subscribe to Coral, because that's everybody.